we had complaints about noise. The boondocker system was kind of noisy. Uh, they, uh, there's really no excuse for that because they exit in the tunnel and it should be an easier place to, to roll decibels off. Um, but uh, I guess because maybe they, we were in a bit of a hurry when that whole system was put together and we used a glass pack system and it wasn't. So now we have a new muffler. It's fantastic, it's quiet. Uh, it's a really clean system. You can see it, it's in a, in a few booths out here. It's really a nice, nice kit. And that brings the DB down way below. Um, I mean, it's very nice sound. So that's one of the updates. The other was a bunch of electronic updates. Uh, there was some things that happened in, in factory ECU programming that we didn't catch that we needed to change and, and learn to adapt and, and kind of work with, um, as well as some general programming and changes to what we do there. So that you'll see a pretty significant increase in runnability <clears throat> on the 17 updates to 16. So anybody that's got a 16 really should get with the guy that did their install and, and work forward on, on, on relevant updates electronically. That's probably where the biggest changes were made. Uh, intake change too, but it's, it's not as significant. I mean, I, I guess I don't feel like it is. So I think we had a pretty competent intake as long as we kept things installed right and sealed right. So.